When it comes to looking great, knowing what's in style is only half the battle. You can wear the hottest trends, but if you don't know how to wear them, it can spell a fashion disaster. I'm here with Christina McDowell, the image consultant for Holt Renfrew. Christina's going to take us through some of the hottest fall trends and just how to wear them. Welcome Zenka and welcome to all of you flair readers at home. Fall is a very exciting time here at Holt Renfrew. The fashions are dropping every day. I'm like a kid in a candy store with so much of the selection and I'd love to show you some of them. One of the Trends I think you're going to see a lot of people wearing this fall, the 70s inspired pant. It's a high-waisted, dropping from the hip, wider trouser, and it would be great on a number of different body types. It's quite flattering. Now, what would you wear with a pant like this? Well, I think I would, because the bottom, we we're looking for balance and a look like this, so you'd, you'd, have, you'd have a cropped, very sculpted piece on top, whether it's a jacket or a sweater. And then the other way to wear it is with one of the boyfriend cardigans. They're a little bit oversized and you'd belt it, so it's a very fluid look in that regard. A look that you'll be seeing a lot of this fall is the Neo Jodhpur. So really what it is, is a very linear, clean day look, replaces last year's legging, and you'd pair it with this season's new bow blouse. And we're looking at them um, in prints, in colors, and in sh silk chiffons. You tuck it into the jodhpur, almost um, like a riding outfit. And of course, it's completed with this very sculpted Balenciaga blazer. I don't know if the camera can pick this up. This is sort of a midnight ink. Um, needs to be on the body for you to really appreciate how the look, um, how the look is worn. I think another trend that we'll certainly be seeing on our Canadian streets because of our, our famous winters is cardigan dressing, sweater dressing. And basically it's a transition period where you don't necessarily need a coat, but something like this shawl collared sweater coat fits the bill. It's perfect. Nice option to a coat. If you don't want something that heavy, I think this cashmere long cardigan uh, also works over the jodhpur look that we just looked at. Perfect. I love this one. I think that a, a look that I love wearing in the in the fall into winter, the puffa. The puffa is back big time, and Prada offers us every option that we could possibly want, from a vest to a jacket to a car coat length, and even to a full length. Varying details, varying uh, style options for you. Now, is a coat like this going to add bulk or weight to someone's figure? The way that they've done it, it's not like parkas of the past or puffas of the past. They actually, if you put them on, you'll see a much more sort of refined puffa, which is not the Michelin man anymore. I think that you'll love, uh, you'll love the look when you put this on. One of my favorite trends of this season is going to be the lean skirt, and that's because it suits so many different body types. It's perfectly proportionate to a lot of bodies, Wear it just hovering at the knee, very flattering. Add a jacket to it, add a sweater, or as we see here, worn with a crisp, minimalist white shirt. You know what I'd like to do? Instead of just showing you the clothes, why don't we go see them on real people? Come on up to the personal shopping suites, and I'll show you follow weight in action. And this first look is the, is the ubiquitous boyfriend jacket that we're gonna see all over the place. It's an elongated silhouette, and it's uh, paired with the 70s inspired denim, which is darker and a wider leg. The wider leg works for a lot of body types because it balances the shoulder hip ratio. In other words, your shoulder and your hip is then balanced by the, the width at the bottom and really keep them long because it becomes very much about a linear look. So if Kelly takes off this, this boyfriend jacket by Smythe, you realize that you can then you know, go out to dinner in this, go to a club in this, you look very polished, very pulled together. And uh, this particular trend is an interpretation of the bow blouse cut out um, at the shoulder. I love it, easy, chic, very wearable. So this look is great for a corporate office look. It's the new power suit in a pinstripe that elongates the silhouette. Pinstripes have been back for a while, but really in this sculpted suit, I think it works very well for someone that perhaps has a fuller bust because it has the single button. So it sort of tucks in underneath the bust. What I've done is juxtapose it with a feminine 
silk chiffon blouse that if April takes her jacket off, you'll see it's very soft, very billowy, which is certainly on trend, and a fuller sleeve that perhaps um, women that have concerns with their arms would, would choose something like this because it works, it's flattering, and you really can take it into the evening as well. For our final look, let's look at how to step out into the town in style. We're looking at a topper coat in the perfect on-trend color, which is blues and indigos. Really terrific silhouette for a lot of body types because it elongates the silhouette. Underneath, again an on-trend color, of course red, flattering for really most skin types. This dress has terrific detail, drawing the eye to the waist. Finish it off with a fabulous statement piece around the neck, which frames the face beautifully. Don't forget, shoulders back, great big smile, and own the look. Confidence is key. Thanks for joining us on this edition of How to Wear It. Join us next time to learn how to wear our favorite holiday looks.